This program is brought to you in part by Technology Credit Union. Clear skies, sunshine, and a pleasant breeze drew crowds in the hundreds to the Cupertino Diwali Mela. The festival aptly takes place in October, which marks the beginning of various Hindu festivals of India, from Navratri and Durga Puja to the most awaited Diwali. As is customary for these festivals, folks prepare by shopping for clothing, jewelry, and puja artifacts. Held at Memorial Park in Cupertino, the Mela is truly festive now in its 11th year. There's no secret. I think it's uh, a good event, you know, set up by a lot of good people with a lot of time and everything, and people love it. Divinity has been kind, the weather is good, and, you know, that's how it happens here. Yeah. Local leaders like Fremont Vice Mayor Anu Natarajan says she's happy to cross county borders to support the larger Indian American community. I think it's important for us as a region to look at each other as good neighbors. So yes, I've come not, a, not only across cities, but across the county border too. Um, but it's, it's just important for us all to band together as Indian Americans, as we, as we cherish our um, culture, our traditions, and celebrate as a region. The South Asian Heart Center was a big sponsor of the Mela. They decided to hold a heart-healthy luncheon for their donors to demonstrate their impact on the community firsthand. We're a district hospital, we're a community hospital, so we try to reflect our community. We have a tremendous South Asian population in our community. We try to work more and more with broad community health aspects. And frankly, we hitched our bandwagon to the star of Ashish. I mean, he's the one that's really made this, so we've come along and supported him where we could. Well, the center has come a long way because of these people that uh, trusted in the work of the center at the very beginning and on, on an ongoing basis. So it's a donor appreciation event. Uh, we did it so that they could also come out here and see what we do in the community. Very often they are at a gala or at a fundraiser and they are, you know, raising money for us, with us at those events. But they don't get to see us in action. Today at this Cupertino Diwali Mela, uh, we have a big presence. We kind of want to educate uh, our community about heart issues, diabetes that's very prevalent. Uh, and so we thought that we'd get our donors here as donor appreciation, but they get to see our work in the community as well. The center also worked with food vendors across the Mela to provide heart-healthy meal choices for festival patrons. day of non-stop dance performances from Kathak to Bollywood and even hula dancing. Dance groups from all ages and all over the Bay Area participated in the Mela Entertainment. In attendance were several elected officials who came to show their support. Uh, we have to observe these cultural events more and more because I think it creates better understanding in our community and I think better understanding leads to a better community, a more happy community. But the glue that holds us all together, that glue is like, is the Diwali festival. Bringing community together to celebrate, not just the past year, but to celebrate our future for the next year. And the Asian Indian American population is a large segment of the of the, the cultural diversity in the 28th Assembly District. And I love the cultural diversity in this district. After the awards, for many, it was time to start shopping for Diwali. Jewelry vendor Maria Hassanji has been coming to Diwali Mela for five years now and loves the exposure the festival presents. It is always a great response. It's nice to have an event, you know, that's all totally Indian based. Of, uh, people come in, get to come in here and uh, do some uh, Indian shopping. Everything in, under one uh, event, you know. They get to pick their dresses, they get to pick their jewelry. Right. So it, it's, it's overall, it's a great experience as always. And even for those who aren't into dancing and shopping, there are still plenty of activities for everyone. One more, one more. Uh, I come here for the, the culture and the aromas and the colors and the music. Food, music, art, I, mean, I love meeting people. So I enjoy, you know, seeing all the colors, it's so beautiful. 
and the weather is nice, so this is a wonderful place to be. And it's this wide-ranging diversity that brings people back year after year.